It's been said that writing down your tasks and goals can help you achieve them better and faster. With our ever-changing lives, it's becoming harder and harder to keep track of all of our tasks in a neat and organized fashion. I'm Daniel from the world of Apple, and today I'll be reviewing the software that Cultured Code made to try to solve this problem. It's called Things. So let's get started. As I open up things, you'll notice just how fast it is, and that is one thing that I found for sure throughout my testing of this application. Whether it's starting up the application or adding a new task, it always works very quickly. As you can see from the window that opens, Things has a very similar structure to some other Mac applications that I've mentioned in the past. But the one thing that you won't find is an inspector. This is one of the many features of Things that make it stand out from the crowd and make for a simple and easy to use application that is still very functional. As you can see on the left is the sidebar, which has the inbox, a place for all of your tasks to go before you sort them, today and next, which highlights tasks which you need to do today or later, scheduled, which shows events that you've created to present themselves in the future, Someday, which is a spot for any task that you want to remember, but not be nagged about right now. Also, there's projects, which are basically like folders for groups of tasks. Areas, which are specific context for your tasks. And people, partners who you can assign tasks to. Finally, there's a logbook for completed tasks, and a trash for deleted ones. One really cool and easy to use feature that I found out about things is the quick entry panel. You can customize a hotkey in the preferences and when you press that combination from any application on your Mac the quick entry panel will pop up as long as things is running. You'll notice that I highlighted a section of this document and when I press the key combination the quick entry panel popped up with my highlighted text as a note. You'll notice that any to do I add automatically goes to the inbox, unless I tell it otherwise. Now let's look at what you can do with this to-do from here. I can drag it to the Today folder, or just click the Today button in the toolbar, and it will automatically go to Today. If I don't want to make it Today, I can click the Today button again, and it will be sent to the next folder. In the next folder, I can see an organized, collapsible list view of all of my tasks whether they are in folders, areas, or assigned to people. Now that this task is in the next folder, I can file it in several other ways. If I click the plus icon over here, I can add a new project. I'll type in a name, and then go back to the next folder, and drag my task into it. I can also assign a specific task to an area, and assign entire projects, or just single tasks, to people. Another feature of Things that helps keep your tasks organized is Tags. So I'll add a new task, and then click the Tags button. From here, I can drag tags from the pop-up right to the task. In addition, I can customize tags to my liking, and even add single key shortcuts, so that if I click a task and hit W, the Work tag will be applied to it. In any folder, you can choose to display tasks with specific tags. Cultured Code has really hit the nail on the head with all of the features for organizing your tasks. Other task managers have either too few features or are bloated with unnecessary features. Things manages to get the best of both worlds by having many features in an organized and non-intrusive way, but still maintains all of the functionality that you would expect and more. There is also an iOS version of Things which will sync with the desktop version and keep all of your tasks properties. Through my testing, I found the syncing to be very quick and works very well. The iPhone application is excellent and has all of the functionality of the Things desktop version. Things currently retails for 50 US dollars. Overall, I was really impressed with Things performance. It was very fast and always responsive regardless of what I was doing. The organization and layout were really efficient and fits perfectly in with Apple's own software. 
I would recommend things to anyone willing to pay the $50 price tag for a fantastic way to sort and manage your tasks. Like every application, there are some ways that I think things can improve. First, an improved people feature would really be a huge plus, especially if the user wasn't tied to address book contacts only and had a way to sync tasks with people, but I hear this may be coming in a future version. Also, syncing with iOS devices could be improved by having it done over the internet so that both the device and the Mac don't have to be on the same network in order to sync. The bottom line is that Things is a fantastic application and it's great for organizing your tasks and helping you get them done efficiently and on time. I found that Things is the type of application that you can only realize how great it is after you try it, so I highly recommend that you check out Things website at www.culturedcode.com and download the free trial version. Thanks for watching another video by the World of Apple. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe.